This is my fish holding tank. It's a light that I got from a hardware store with a full spectrum bulb in it and some plants that happens to be Hydrocotta leucocephala, cephala, Brazilian pennywort. And um, I like it because it's fast growing. The faster the plant grows, the more nitrogen it's going to eat. And Brazilian pennywort doesn't need a substrate, so this is a bare bottom tank. You can see there's algae growing on the bottom. And that's a heater because these fish are holding fish and I can't sell them until they grow so the water's heated so they grow faster because they're guppies. Guppy metabolism depends on the temperature. You can see there's not very much water in here, just enough to cover the heater because this tank is a Rubbermaid Clever Store tub. They are $14.97 apparently. Um, so they're a little bit expensive and you can you can get them for like seven bucks. Um, I think this one was a gift. But anyway, so the tubs will break if you put more water in it. Like water all the way up to here is not a good idea. The sides start to bow out, so they'll be like, yeah. And um, so I only put that much water in it, and that's a sustainable amount. This tub has been set up for, oh, almost a year. Hmm, it's a long time. And you can see the sides are straight and not bowing. When they bow out, they're like, wow. So, um, the light does fall in sometimes. It's not a big deal. I just shake it off. It's an under cabinet light, so, it, in a shop light, so it's a little bit water resistant. And honestly, I've dunked it in here like a hundred times. No problems. So, um, anyway, that is my holding tank. You can see the fish are quite happy. They don't have any fin rot or anything like that. The plant growth is what protects them. You just feed them fish flakes like normal and the plant eats it. The surface area of the water also protects them so they don't run out of oxygen. The diffusion rate is high enough with such a, a thin amount of water and a large surface area that they don't need like filters or anything. So it's a completely quiet tank. And, um, and if you've got some room outside, I live in an apartment, but if you've got a yard, you don't even need this light, you can just put this outside. And the fish eat mosquitoes, so it's like not a bad idea. Um, you could probably save some money on fish food. So anyway, that is my holding tank. I call it a bucket tank sometimes, because you could just use a bucket. See, thin water is the trick. Large surface area. You can put as many fish as you want in there. I've got a lot, you know what I mean? Not a big deal, because the plant. The plant is your friend. Yay, plant. So, yep, that's it.